pieces. All right. What up to my peoples and welcome back to Retro Crunch, your nostalgia show that is all about retro. And if you're a huge Back to the Future fan, now is your chance to own a piece of history. The original Back to the Future sneaker worn by Marty McFly and used in the movie is up for sale. And you can bid on it right now on eBay. But the bad news is it's only the left shoe and this shoe is disintegrating. This isn't a knockoff that you can buy for a few hundred bucks or a commercial remake. It's actually one of the shoes that was made specifically for the movie. But this shoe for sale on eBay is definitely the original. It was worn by Michael J. Fox in the movie and there were only a handful of them made in 1989. So it is the holy grail purchase for most sneaker lovers. What's just as interesting though is the condition the sneaker is in. Even though it's been kept in a glass display case for all these years, the fabric seems to be holding up okay, but the rubber and foam sections of the shoe are rotting away really, really bad. And the back heel cup is so bad that it is just crumbling to pieces. It can be handled only by someone with museum level care. So you're gonna have to pick up the shoe in Portland if you're the winning bidder. And Shoeseum is the online name of the shoe collector Jordan Geller, who back in 2016 said that he was going to sell off all of his stash of sneakers. And it looks like this is part of that collection. The Air Max have been released by Nike a few times since 1989, most recently complete with an automatic lacing system. And each time they've sold for thousands of dollars. So if you're a bit too broke or squeamish like I am to fork out $80,000, you can get some knockoffs off eBay for a few hundred bucks. I'll post a link to the auction down below for you guys, so happy hunting. All right, my fellow retro heads, I hope you all enjoyed this retro news update, and I'll catch you all on the flip side. And remember, if it ain't retro, it ain't worth watching.